All right, this video is a short continuation of our original introduction of if statements. I have over here a script, similar to what we were working on before, that takes in the temperature in Fahrenheit, and then we have a set of if statements to print if it is hot, really hot, or cold outside, or basically normal. Take a look at these if statements. There's actually a hidden mistake, a logical hidden mistake, in how this particular state set of statements is put together. Let's go ahead and run it. I'm going to go ahead and run it first off with 95 degrees. I hit run module. That's what the temperature is in Fahrenheit. I hit 95. Hit enter. It prints that it is hot outside and we're done. And take a look at the if statements there. If temperature is greater than 90, which 95 is, it will print out that it is hot outside. Okay, so my, for my next sample one run, I want to print out the second statement, it is so hot that we could print fry eggs on the pavement. Let's go ahead and give that a try. I'm going to run the module. And I figure 120 degrees ought to be greater than enough, the 110 required, to print out frying the eggs in the pavement. But actually I'm getting that it's hot outside. So let's flip back to this. Take a moment and pause, take a look at that program and see if you can figure out what the error is. All right, so the deal here is we entered 120. Keep in mind that the computer looks at these statements line by line. It doesn't look at them as a whole. We as humans can take a look at that and figure, oh, okay, 120, that's greater than 110. That's probably what the user the programmer wanted. But actually the computer goes statement by statement. So when we enter 120, we hit the first statement. Is 120 greater than 90? It is indeed. We print out that it is hot outside. The else says basically if nothing of what happened ahead matched, then we're going to do the second statement. But it did match. 120 is greater than 90, so there is no else to be done and the computer's done executing statements. There is no way to execute that second statement that we could fry eggs on the pavement because any number greater than 110 is also going to be greater than 90. So what we have in here is a logical error in the ordering of these particular statements. We simply can't do what we've listed here. What I need to do in order to fix this is delete this, make this 110, go down here, and do the higher order check first. And then move this back to 90. So in some cases the order that we do these statements is very important. So now the program will work because if I go ahead and run it and I enter 120, 120 is greater than 110 and it'll print that I could fry eggs in the pavement. And if I enter 95, it's not greater than 110, it'll fall down and it'll execute the second statement for greater than 90. And past that, the rest of the statements should work just fine. If I enter 20, it'll hit to that it's cold outside. And anything basically between 30 and 90, inclusive, should print that it is okay on Sour. 